G'day, I'm Gail, and welcome to day three of our seven day decluttering challenge. Our 15 minutes starts now, so let's get that timer on. Thank you for everyone who commented yesterday. It's really fun to do this together. Today, we're gonna to focus on our hanging space. I'm gonna keep it short because you probably have a few wardrobes to go through in your 15 minutes. Today's tip is really, really simple. We're gonna take everything out of our wardrobe and we're gonna make sure that all the coat hangers are facing outwards. So the pointy bit facing to you. And we're just gonna turn everything in our, our wardrobe around and we're gonna put like with like. So all the dresses together, all the high vis t-shirts together or whatever you've got in your wardrobe, all the pants, all the formally kind of dresses. You probably find that some of your clothes are facing one way and some's facing the other way, but we're gonna point them all facing out like that, like with like. But then when we come to, we're gonna wear some clothes, we take it out, we wear the dress, we wash the dress, we put it back in with the point facing the wall the right way around. So we wear something, we wash it, we put it back in the right way around. Then when you come to declutter, maybe you get a blue bag in the mail, you're doing a school holiday declutter, you can see at a glance, what have you worn since you last declutter in the last three months, six months or a year? You can easily see that, hey, I haven't worn this dress. The coat hanger's facing the wrong way around haven't worn this dress and it's a good sign that maybe I won't wear it again. So uh, that one can come off the hanger and into the bag. The other thing by having like with like is that we can see what we've got multiples of. Remember we're talking about the maths of stuff yesterday and multiples. So most of us have multiples of something. Black pants, um, white office shirts for the men or like me, I've got a ridiculous number of high vis church for life shirts. So let's have a little count. I'm wearing this one, number one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. I've got 14 high vis t shirts. And as we learned yesterday, that's way too many. So because they're all together, I can see that. I can count one, two, three, four, five, and all of these can go in the bag, somebody else can wear it. Now we do get asked occasionally, can you take uniforms? Absolutely. My Church for Life little logo won't mean anything in Outback Africa. It's just a shirt that someone can wear and maybe the only high vis they can get. So yes, we take uniforms. So that's your challenge today. In the next 12, 13 minutes, go to your wardrobes, one, two, whatever you've got time for, quickly flip all the coat hangers out so the points facing you put like with like have a look at those multiples what have you got too many of in the bag and then when the timer goes off you're done today we would like for you to comment tell us how many bags have you filled already this week and i will see you back tomorrow for day four